So there's an issue that uh, was actually brought to my attention by Kraut and T, uh, who normally is not a fan of Muslims immigrating to the, the West, but in this case, uh, for some reason, there's an exception. Um, don't understand that. Maybe he can clarify that for me later. But uh, she is a Saudi Arabian woman who uh, left Saudi Arabia, uh, fleeing from her abusive family, uh, how she was escaping her life in Saudi Arabia, going to Australia to seek political asylum. Um, she's likely in Saudi Arabia to be uh, honor killed or at the very least uh, horribly punished, uh, subject to, to probably some forms of torture or whatever. Uh, she was abused by her family, and the abuse that she suffered was totally acceptable in the context of the culture that she lives in. And she's trying to flee from that country. She's trying to get the fuck out. Now, I don't think Trump gives a fuck about Dinah. I don't think he gives a fuck. Uh, I mean, like, he's anti-Muslim immigrant. And in fact, most of the people now championing this girl are traditionally anti-Muslim immigrant. But for some reason, this time around, it's, it's different. I don't know. Maybe because they're just emotionally moved by this girl's story. Uh, maybe it's just for them an opportunity to point out the hypocrisy of SJWs. I don't know why this girl is being singled out for, oh, immigrants are dog shit, but this one girl... Oh, she's so, so pure, so wonderful. Don't understand the cognitive dissonance there. I can't believe the, the strange hypocrisy I see on both sides of it.